David? What are you doing? Vicky! Sorry, George called. He said he has something big. You promised you can stay home today. I know what I said, but I guess it is something important. Oh, okay. So I guess this is more important than us now. God, you are unbelievable. Hey, 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 calm down. Your anger is getting the best of you. Stuff like this just happens. It's part of the business. It won't happen again. Love you. Oh, hey, don't forget to take your meds. It's what you need right now. David, you're here today. I am. After all, you did call me in, George. I did? Yeah, so if anyone asks, you got an important job for me. I... wait, what? I'm talking about my wife, George. I had to get out of there. That's right, that thing. Um, I don't get why you just don't leave, man. Why, why stay? Trust me, I'll be signing my death warrant along with the divorce papers. You just don't know her as well as I do. Whatever, man. You do you. Just how you do it, I'll, I'll never know. Hey, next time, realize what I'm doing without me having to spell it out for you. I swear one of these days you're gonna get me caught. Come in. Um, I'm looking for a David Ocasio. Uh, yeah, you're talking. Oh, uh, may I sit? Yes, sorry. Have a seat. Where are my manners? It's all right. So, what can I do for you? Well, I don't know how to say this, but, um, I think I'm being cheated on. Oh, really? Well, you've come to the right place. Please tell me everything. So, it, um, it started when he... to do anymore. I mean, there are times when I feel like he loves me, but the rest just feels so unbearable to even be around him. I don't know what to do. Mandy, you've always been there for me. What should I do? Vicky, I'm going to be honest. I didn't like David from the beginning. Okay. He reminds me too much of my husband. So from my experience and my love for you as a friend, I'm telling you, leave him. I can't do that. Mandy, I love him. When we first met, he was everything I wanted in a man. He was, he was caring, he was kind, he was supportive. 
And he actually made me feel happy. How can I give that up? I mean, yeah, he's been a total pain recently. Oh, sorry, I forgot about this. Oh, I have to go over here. Oh, 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 it's just one thing after another, after another, and it just doesn't stop. At this point, I could just, I could just strangle him if that's what it takes for him to understand me. Okay, Vicky. Without him, I'm nothing. I'm nothing but lonely again. You know, I won't have anyone to love, and I won't have anyone to love me back. I can't live in that world again. I just wish everything could go back to how it was before when it was perfect. I just don't understand why it's not. Whatever. You're a lost cause. <sighs> but I'm telling you, you're putting yourself up just to get hurt. More hurt than you get by just walking away. Heck, you're lucky you're just married to him. If it weren't for Alex here, I would have left my husband a long time ago. Give him the bird and fly the hell away. You know, every now and then I think about <sighs> it and I... Hoping. All right. Well, if you want my advice, find what's hurting your relationship. Find a problem and work to fix it. And the one after that, and the one after that, and so on and so forth. Heck, it's as simple as that. I've even tried it myself. It just... Turns out that we've got too many problems. Jeez, you're insane, Mandy. Says you. So here's what I found. Terribly sorry, Andy. How can I let this happen? What did I do wrong? It's not your fault. I mean, it's not an easy task finding the right person. It's good that you're doing this. You can get out of the relationship if it's too late. I just feel responsible. Like I said, it's not your fault. He's the one that made the decision, not you. He's the one that he's going to be held accountable, right? Yeah, I, I guess you're right. It's just that he... Never mind. It's, it's over. Thank you, David. Just tell me how much I owe you. Wait, 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 hold on, hold on. What are you doing? You can relax, it's fine. I thought we were done. Well, yeah, but I mean, you know, your emotions are running high. I mean, you're going through something. Don't you think it's nice to you know, relax? Have a drink, you know? I don't know. I'm not feeling too well. I get it. It's hard, you know, going through these types of things, but my best advice would just to, would be just to, you know, relax, have fun, you know? That's right. Are you sure? Yeah. I've done with my past clients. You know, I wouldn't have said this earlier, but it's different now. Why can't all guys be as caring as you? <laughs> Don't imply things that you shouldn't be implying, especially while your boyfriend's out, you know. I think it's okay to turn you around. Alright, well, why don't you tell me a little bit more about yourself? And you can leave out the whole boyfriend part I already know. Well, I'm currently studying medicine and I work as a part time nurse. Before I was a PI, I also started, you know, looking into doctors and things like that. Really? Yeah. What changed? Well, it was kind of back when I was heading into college. It was... You decided to come home. Where were you? Where 
work? What are you still doing up? Just waiting on you. So we can continue our anniversary. And if, wait, what? You forgot our anniversary. Of course you did. You see, I don't know why I expected anything more from you. Why would you do this to me? Do you know how much I love you? Aki? Please. Why is it so hard for you to treat me the same? Aki, please. I'm Why did you treat me like this? Aki, I'm sorry. Please, just let me make it up to you. Okay. Okay, well, you can start by being home more often. David, if I didn't know you any better, I would think that you were cheating on me. Vicky, Vicky, come on. Are you even listening to yourself? You know how much I love you. Oh, I, who's there to help you through your worst days? Who's there to calm you down? It's just, work's been really demanding lately. I'm constantly being thrown at other people's problems, and I, I gotta look out for jealous pricks off of my neck because I've ruined their lives. You can't blame me for being a bit miserable at times. <laughs> I don't believe you. I don't believe you. You say that you love your job. I do, but when I come home and all I'm greeted to is a wife who complains, it makes me wonder why I'm still here. I, I, don't, know what, I don't know what to do anymore. No, no, if you truly believe that, you should have done something about it. Mickey. Because to me, it looked like you didn't care for me anymore. Mickey, please. No, no, listen. Tomorrow is Friday. Why don't you take the entire day off and we can spend it the whole day together, or just be you and me, and, and we can make it up for today. Thank you. Tomorrow's really not a good day. I already have an appointment set up. Are you kidding me? Look, I just have some important things I need to do first. Okay? Wow. That's not what you should be saying to me right now, but okay. Let's just, let's just go to bed. I Make it up, I promise. No, no. I'm gonna bed. You can. I don't know, you can stay here. understand how much behavior can be a turn off for anyone. Maybe we should take a break. To gather our senses.
Vicky, what are you doing here? What? I'm not allowed to visit my own husband. Well, of course, but he's not here right now. I have eyes, George. Where is he? He, he went off on assignment. I, I really don't know. So he went off on an assignment and he didn't tell you where he went? You know how George is? He, he's, he's like a lone wolf, you know? No, I don't know. Where is he? I'm sorry, I, I couldn't tell you. Couldn't or won't? I'm gonna make you a deal, George. You tell me where David is, and I won't tell him how his partner's been trying to seduce his wife. What are you talking about? I, I've never done such a thing. Who's he gonna believe? You? <laughs> I... Uh... What's it gonna be, George? Honey, I'm home. Honey, Vicky. Hey, Andy. I, I didn't expect to see you again. What are you doing here? I just came by to drop off David's film. Is something wrong with that? No, it's it's just that um There's something I need to tell you. You need to leave. David's a married man, okay? And there's this woman, and sh she's... Vicky. Vicky, what are you doing? I just want to talk to this nice woman over here, George. Why don't you let us be? Just for a little bit. You leave her alone. Please, it's nice to meet you. Vicky, you stay right there. You should have told me sooner, George. <laughs>
David, wake up. Wake up, please! Please. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Can I help you? Hey, I'm uh, Detective Leo. I'm looking for a Vicky Ocasio. Have you seen her around? Really need to talk to her. Vicky, I got some guy here who wants to talk to you. She's here? Yeah, she's been with me all day. Why? Uh, I can't really tell you that. Whatever. What's up? Hello, Vicky. I'm uh, really sorry we have to meet on these circumstances. Why? What happened? Really sorry, but David was killed today in his office. Alongside his partner, George, and a female victim who we believe was a client. I don't believe it. That's not true. That's... that's not... Could you give me a second? Why? Who did this? You know I can't tell you that. Leo, I've known you for as long as I've known David. Okay, I'm his wife. All right, we've got some pretty hard evidence on the client's boyfriend. We searched his place and we saw a murder weapon as well as some photos that David took of him stuffed in the trash. It's not a lot, but it doesn't look good on his side. Why hasn't he been charged yet? Uh, evidence is still a little iffy, but it's definitely enough to build a case. I still don't know why he did it. Jealousy. That's all it is. I've seen great man fall to it. Thanks, Leo. And I'm sorry. And it's a friend of David's, which means friend of yours. So if you need anything, let me know. Hey. What, what's wrong? David's dead. I'm lost, I don't know what to do. Oh my gosh, Vicky, I'm so sorry. Do you think I can, um, do you think I can stay here for a while? Of course, you can stay as long as you need. something that might help.
I need all the evidence rechecked and the case file ready for me on my desk. Something's not right.